One thing I like to do when I'm fishing new water, and especially clear water like this river here, the water is always very clear because it's the tail water of a big dam, is I'll start with a nymph that I have a lot of faith in. And I'll usually start with a fairly large nymph because I think I'm going to show it to more fish that way. If I'm not having much luck with that, I'll generally move down to that same nymph in a smaller size. I may move down from a, say from a 12 to a 14. If that doesn't work, I may go to a 16 in that nymph. If that doesn't work, I'll try to fish with something that I know is in the river in, in abundance. It may be scuds, it may be shrimp, it may be um, crest bugs, something like that, but I'll try to fish a pattern of the, the substance I think those fish are eating the most. If I'm not getting any success on that, I may go to something very tiny, like midge larvae, which are in almost every river in America, and I may go to very small flies like this that may be an 18, even a 20. And in accordance with that, I'll use a very light tippet. So generally what I'll do is I'll start large, work it down in a favorite pattern. If I'm not having any luck, then I'll go to something I think is going to be in the river in abundance, and then start sh shrinking that down and using smaller tippets all the way.